address anything in the bye week specifically or just kind of? Uh, you know, just sharpening up the, you know, the basic stuff and just getting healthy really was our main focus this bye week. What do you think of their pass rush Arkansas State? I think they're, uh, they have one of the best pass rushes in the Sun Belt for sure. They, uh, they have a lot of depth there too, which helps with the D-line so they can keep guys fresh, you know, every series and uh, they'll come at you full speed, you know, every, every play. So I think uh, it's going to be a challenge, but we're up for it. Um, what do you, would you, do you, do you have to find the, the Jones kid, the defensive lineman every play, or is it just a matter of trusting your guys up front? Yeah, I think it's, um, you know, just trusting the guys. Uh, we don't have a really game plan set on one player, uh, but yeah, it's really, I trust O-line and, you know, we got Dez and Sage coming back this week, so that'll be good for us. Talk about the last game without those two guys. I mean, you still moved the ball fairly well. Were you... Did it take a while in the game for you to kind of relax and realize it's going to be okay, or were you? Were you... No, I think I think it was you know the same as every week. Um, you know, our philosophy is next guy up, and they the two guys that replaced them did a great job, and I didn't really notice any difference in the protection, so it was good. You played Arkansas State a few times now, so I mean they're usually right up there at the top of the league. What do you what do you think of them as a program, I guess, and what would it mean on Saturday? I think they're a great program. You know, they've proven themselves, like you said, every year in the Sun Belt. And, uh, you know, to beat them would be, uh, you know, be big for us. And that's what we, you know, hope to do. So. Do you think the team has developed an expect victory mentality each week? Yeah, I think uh, we have a confidence that, you know, wasn't here before that, you know, we expect to go out every week and, and play good football and, and get a win. And, uh, I think that's important to have on a team, you know, just to have that belief beforehand. So, definitely. What do they play in coverage time? What do they do back there? Uh, you know, they're quarters team, uh, mainly quarters. Yeah. One more questions, Danny and Ken. You all set? Yeah, exactly. That's uh, pretty much the mindset right now around here is, uh, you know, it was nice having a bye week, but at the same time, we're ready to go back out and play. So it'll be it'll be exciting to get get back out there this Saturday. And now, Tom, obviously, you don't play directly against uh, the other team's quarterback, but going into the you guys are one and two, basically, as far as passing in the uh, in the Sun Belt. Do you, uh, do you take a little extra pride in trying to, you know, trying to outdo their passing game a little bit? I mean, no. Not really. I just, I just want to win. <laughs> I don't you, think about all that. Do you watch other quarterbacks? Uh, you, you mentioned like I asked you about Lamb. You seem like like his game, but I don't know. Does yeah. You, do you like watching some of these guys? I definitely like watching the Sun Belt teams. You know, play especially you know against Power Five schools. You know, hope to see him. You know, pull one from them. So, I mean, those are the really the games I like to watch. So.